these bangs, I promise you. I love them and I don't love them. I love my bangs because I have a huge forehead. Hey y'all, what's poppin'? It's your girl Natty Rock Berry. I'm the Berry. Hi. Um, welcome back to my channel. As you guys can see, we are not rocking a tail. Um, there is a winter storm going on and I really just wanted to come here, do this video really, really quick, go home and wash my hair and just completely decompress. So I'm so sorry about this hot mess. <laughs> um, today's video is going to be about how to radiate feminine energy. How to radiate feminine energy. Yes, berries, that is what we are going to talk about today. You know, all of these feminine characteristics, y'all, they tie into each other, like being kind or being soft. I feel like one leads into another and one leads into the other. In yourself in places where, in situations where you can be more receiving, then you're going to be able to have an ability to be complimentary because you receive so many compliments. Okay, feminine quality that could help you to radiate feminine energy is being joyful. Yes, berries. Okay, for example, so one of the things that give me true, honest joy is by, um, I don't know, taking care of my dad. Yeah, I take care of my dad. I make sure that I cook dinner for him. I try to be there for him the way I can. Sometimes I feel guilty because I do have to leave and go to work. I do like to take time and take care of myself, but at the same time, berries, I must do these things, okay? I must. If I don't, ugh. I tapping into that one thing that gives me true, honest joy. I discovered kindness, and I also discovered how to be more patient as a result. I'm like, I keep patting my chest. I need to stop doing that. Oh my gosh, what am I, am I like on here just like, I don't know why I do that, berries. I know y'all be like, ooh, she be. Patience for other individuals who are blessed with wisdom. I love seeing little old ladies at the grocery store who are like, you know, they have like two oranges or something like that. And I'm just like, you can go in front of me. You know, like I love making sure that they get to their car safely. Um, I'm that girl. Old guys and they're like trying to like reach something and her, I try to help them. You know, I just think that like doing that and being there and, and, and you know, mm, I'm sorry. Um, being there for my dad has helped me to not only increase my joy, but it has also helped me to become more feminine. And by doing that, like I'm just, I have so much more patience for people, oh my God. <sighs> Take a deep breath and I just, Yes, how may I help you? <laughs> Walk away. Okay, just really truly has been a blessing and a gift. Okay, berries. That brings me to my next point. How to radiate feminine energy. Well, honey, you have to keep up with your appearance. Berries, keep up with your appearance. Like seriously, one thing I really do like to indulge in, berries, is getting my nails done. Shout out to Lay It On Thick. She did my nails today. Um, this is my set. I'm calling it Abundance of Love. I love getting my nails done. I feel like it is like one of the most consistent thing that I do and it also allows me to let someone else do something for me. And it makes me feel beautiful. It makes me feel so gorgeous. I just love it so much. Keeping up with your appearance could just be simply making sure you get your toes done, making sure that you wash your hair. Start with something so simple, a simple gift that you can provide yourself that will allow you to allow someone else to do something that makes you feel and look beautiful. I promise you, a little goes a long way. Hello, look at this makeup look. This is just a simple eye, a simple adornment. I love it. Do you guys know how I feel about my nails? Well, today in Michigan, it is a 
huge snowstorm that is happening outside of my window. And honestly, I was really thinking like, oh my gosh, how am I gonna get down to, you know, do my clients today? How am I going to be able to, you know, do my video today? And then I received a message saying that I had a nail appointment today. And I was like, yay. <laughs> so thankfully, I had my nail appointment today and I was able to get out early enough right before it started snowing. Yes, Barry, so I'm here. So thankful to my nail addiction, yeah. And also my addiction to my bang. Shout out to her. Ugh, I don't know what to do. Like, see, okay, now I like them. I like them like this. It hides the rhinestones. Barry's, get into this look. Abundance of love. <laughs> Another way to radiate feminine energy is by moving differently, being more polite, always passing out compliments. Sometimes, berries, we must be the givers. And if we're gonna give anything, it could be a nice compliment. Being able to look at someone and just give them a compliment, plant little seeds within a person's bank of esteem is very powerful. I feel that we should all be respectful of each other and we should do it in a way where we can be complimentary. I love to give compliments to the lady at my grocery store. I love giving compliments. Oh, it is so nice. It's, I feel like I love it because I receive so many. Yes, I feel that the reason why I'm able to give so many compliments is because, Berries, I receive so many. Ah, oh, I receive so many. Want to talk about bank of self-esteem? Honey, I got a lot. Sincerely, it's because I take such great pride in being able to tell another person, hey, I love that haircut. Oh my gosh. Girl, I love that nail polish. I love those heels you're wearing. Oh my gosh, is that a blue mascara? I think it's just because I, I don't know, I pay attention to people. Oh. These bangs, I promise you. I love them and I don't love them. I love my bangs because I have a huge forehead. Like, and sometimes I just feel like my forehead can be a little bit overpowering. So I just was like, I'm tired of looking at my forehead. So I put bangs over them. And now I'm just, I'm having a war right now. I am in the middle. <laughs> I'm having such a struggle right now because I don't know if I want to have my bangs like this or if I want to have them out of my life again. I don't know. Berries, please help me. Help me and tell me, what should I do? Also, what do you think of the makeup look? Oh my gosh, I've been seeing everybody do that cute, hold on, can you see it? Okay, I've been seeing everyone do that cute, like, euphoria look. That's why I don't understand, like, should I have a bang or not? Cause like, do I wanna miss, I don't know. So let me know, Berries. okay, gosh. Oh my goodness. In order for us to radiate feminine energy, we have to be able to be receptive. You know, being receptive is a key quality in feminine energy. Receptive is basically, you know, women are receivers. You know, we, we receive things. Okay, yes, I'll take that gift. Okay, you know, thank you for that lovely compliment or, Yes, you. Uh, of guess I need help with X, Y, and Z. It's it's putting us in those places where we have to be like, you know, ladies. You know, saying being polite and saying nice things and and being reminded that you know we are creatures who need to be helped sometimes, and we we are damsels. We're damsels. I hope that's not bad to say or talk about. I don't know. Let me know. Am I the only one? Like, I'm just out here trying to find, I'm just trying to find my people, okay? All right, where y'all at? Where are my bougie, badass berries who like to try on lingerie and take baths and talk about feminine energy? I hope that was a good, cute little conversation that we have had, y'all, because y'all, we have talked, okay? We have talked. So, um, 
Um, that's all I have to say. I'm about to go and try to get through this snowstorm. Um, wash my hair. Oh my gosh, because it's getting late. It's not even five o'clock yet, so I was able to do this all before five. Yay! All right, babe.